there, it's Tara, and today we're going to be exploring Shadow Puppet EDU. But before we get started, please be sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking our logo during the video. Also, give us some feedback or check out our related videos by clicking the pop-up cards in the upper right-hand corner. So let's get started with Shadow Puppet EDU. Shadow Puppet allows teachers and students to create a video slideshow and add their own narration and text on top. Um, you can even get fancy and add a little bit of music if you'd like. When you first click into Shadow Puppet EDU, you're going to see kind of what your dashboard, uh, or see your dashboard. You're going to see some samples in there that already come preloaded, which is really nice for students to be able to see. But you can also, as a teacher, click in on ideas and find some idea lessons from just about any subject area. But we're going to show you how to get started with the app. You're going to click on Create New. From here, you're gonna to wanna to choose some of your video or pictures. You can do that from your camera roll, but they also have libraries built within the app. I'm gonna stick with the camera roll today and I am gonna pull out just a few pictures here, but you can see I can go through and decide to reorder those after I choose them. So I'm gonna just tap, pull down, uh, tap on them, hold it, pull down and adjust where they go, and when I got everything just the way that I wanted, I'm gonna tap next. From here, I could start recording, but I also wanted you to see that there are some um, kind of extras and ways to customize your, your slideshow. So I'm gonna tap on text, and from here, I can add my text. Um, I can adjust um, how it pops in. I can adjust the font that it uses. Um, the placement on the screen, as well as the color. And you can kind of just toggle through some of those choices as opposed to tapping it and all your options coming up. So you may want to toggle through um, ahead of time to kind of see what those options are. But I'm going to leave it there and hit the check mark. Here's where I can also add some custom music for my iTunes library, or they have eight really nice songs built in um, to kind of play in the background. So I'm gonna leave that off for just demonstration purposes, and I'm gonna go ahead and start recording. I bet you've already guessed by now what my narration is going to be. So when I hit the tap button, or hit the start button, you're, you're gonna see a countdown come up, and then on the left-hand side, you're gonna see an additional tool come in. And that tool is the magic wand, and I can tell you students really love this. You're going to see some picture options, and whichever one you choose will be what you can wave out of that magic wand. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to hit start, do a little recording, and then show you a few more of your options. Roses are red. Violets are blue. Sugar is sweet, and so are you. So what I did to kind of go through the slideshow as I was recording uh, was tap on the arrows to the left and right to be able to, to progress my slideshow along. If you get through your recording, you can see right now that it's paused. You do have the option to pause, adjust something, and then go back in and, and start recording. You can also undo what you've last done, your last step, but you can see it says anything you've recorded on this page will be lost. You can also choose to go uh, and tap the left-hand corner, upper left-hand corner, and start from scratch if you decide that you need to do that. But once you have your recording exactly the way you want it, you're gonna tap save. It's currently saving to your dashboard, but you can go and you can actually smash this with a lot of different apps and you can see some of your choices there. I also like that it just gives you a plain link if you need to put it into um, an additional app or, or software or program. But basically once you're done, you tap done and it's gonna be saved to your camera roll, but also right here in the dashboard. So this is Shadow Puppet EDU. Um, like I said earlier, make sure that you subscribe to our channel and we appreciate you tuning in.